Um, my name is Adam, and I attend the University of California, Los Angeles. Prior to recovery, something that I took um, for granted was probably my passion for um, sports, playing sports, because, I don't know, once alcohol and drugs came into the picture, I just completely lost that passion, and um, recovery has given me the chance to start to participate and be physical and um, enjoy sports and watching sports because when I was getting loaded um, I just missed out on so much uh, because I was so focused on getting the next drink or the next drug um, that all my passions which were sports just went out the window. There's a lot of work um, that needs to be done and it happens over a lifetime, it just doesn't happen in one day. Um, but going to meetings, uh, working with a sponsor, um, helping others, being of service, I think it all is a big process in um, healing one from the inside out from their addictions. It is a very deep meaning and it's very personal. Uh, it's a daily reprieve, um, contingent on the maintenance of my spirit, spiritual condition. Um, I am in recovery for alcohol and drugs, and on a daily basis, um, I get a daily reprieve from alcohol and drugs. If I was to talk to someone who said they're too young to be in recovery, I would ask them, um, one, if they thought they had a problem, and two, um, if they were willing to work on that problem, because I was that way. I, I came, I think I went to my first meeting when I was 18, and I just didn't think it was that serious, um, but little did I know that it was only going to get worse, and I think that's what I would say to them, that you could come to a point in your life where you crossed that line of becoming an alcoholic or a drug addict and for most people it doesn't get better.